Hello, dear viewer, and welcome back to Monster Sanctuary with me, Jelen on it, Luna Nebula Gaming. We now have freed Leonard. Leonard Skinner. We're going to try to... No, that's the wrong way. Hmm. Get back into that three-switch area with Julia. How did I do that before? Did I need to do this? No? Hmm. Well, we're going to get in a fight. All right, time to fight. Uh, we could life wave, but I think I'll glory cast. Yeah, I should life wave instead. Hmm. I don't know. We can overheal with dark chewy, basically. The chewy that went to the dark side of the false. But uh, yeah, so far so good. Doing some damage. Mm hmm. Hmm. Chewy took the blindness. That's good. Ah, oh, we took damage. Hmm. Let's help out our friend. That's right, Chewie. We must clap for our friends. Okay. And then... Hmm, I think we go for the other Nautilid since it's lower on health than the Toxic list, but man, it's dodgy. Hmm. Okay. So I think to get rid of the blindness... Hmm. I think I want a Life Wave. That increases our combo up by 7. Then I can go safe cast. That should give 50% chance of getting rid of... Oh, okay. It only helped Chewie. <laughs> oh, Chewie. Latest and greatest. Alright. And then we should just be able to win from here. Alright. Lay down the punishment. And we find victory. There we go. So, how do I get back to that... Three switches. Hmm. Where should we go, Koi? That just leads back up. So I need to do something here. I guess go down as quickly as possible. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Hmm. Let us then talk to our friends. This must be the entrance to the treasure cave. I'm sure of it. I just don't get how we are supposed to open it. I'm pretty sure those switches on the ground are the key to it. Or, more accurately, we are the key. It takes three to enter the Maw of the Beast, remember? So let's just try to stand on those ground switches and see what happens. Alright, let's try it. Victory! Looks kind of like the skull of something opening up. It's kind of fun. I hope those spikes don't kill me if I touch them. Unbelievable. We must be the first people in centuries to enter this cave. Let's see what's inside. After me! Hey, wait a minute. We deserve to get some of those treasures, too. It is true. I clicked a button. Okay. Onward we go. Hmm. Can I go up here at all? It doesn't look like it. So I'm, I'm checking for false backgrounds now that we know that we can fall through some of these and jump through some of them. Ooh, another Nautilid. We still haven't gotten the Nautilid egg. Hmm. I think we still go for our glory. I could do safe cast before we worry about the shield. I guess I'll do that. Yeah. Why not? Okay. Waves. Shadows. They're, uh, they're kind of blind as a bat right now, Chewie. Thank goodness bats have sonar and echolocation. Hmm. I'll do some more ice shield. Okay. More voltage? Yeah. Let's try to get rid of the Nautilid sooner rather than later. Hmm. Looks like Thornish can only protect. Oh, no, he's doing the taunt to protect the thing. Okay. Hmm. Is Ice Hail better against you? No. Okay, well, we'll do this. I hit all those with eight stacks of blindness, huh? Hmm. Okay, interesting. Uh, I guess I won't complain about that. But okay, then. Thornish is looking a little bit shocked by the situation, but, uh... Not enough. Okay. We were very close, but no cigar. Oh, you have four stacks of chill. How do we get there? Hmm. Okay. 
We made it. Not a lid egg, finally. Okay. Ninky Nunker is now at level 30, is weird. Alright, so what do we want? Breaking spells, that seems decent. Elemental break. Ooh, that seems very good. Hmm. I do think I want full defense on you. Hmm. Buff catalyst. Buffs are 20% more effective on this monster. Okay, increased crit chance for attacks that have... Hmm. Hmm. I think we go full defense for now. Okay. Drakonov. Let's get Forge level 2 on you, I think. Dragons in the party region. Never mind, we do that. Okay. Um, what else do we do, friends? Other than swim? And now... Hmm. I think we just go down. We'll check these walls later. Okay. Hmm. We might reach the magma chamber? I don't remember that. We'll get this. 2,000 gold? I'll, I'll take it. All the way to the bank. Ah, I need a platform dude still. Hmm. Okay, Kangamoto. We'll try this anyway, even though it won't work. Yeah. Is that a bird monster? It's a bard. A bird bard. That seems new. Hmm. All right then, Luna. Nope. Uh, we'll try over here. And then we'll try over here. Nothing. Not even a net. Okay. Where we can do? Waving at the algae and the grasses and stuff. All right. And as we go back upwards, we will claw these walls. Nope. Okay. Well, we'll go this way first. Hmm. Treasure. Combo potion. Interesting. Okay, Nautilids, we don't need you anymore. I have one of you. Yoink. We now have Nautilid. All right. I'm just wondering, do you have improved swimming or anything? You do. Unaffected by water streaks. Okay, so yeah, this is how we can go to some of those areas that wouldn't let us through before. Because of the current. We. Oh, well. That happened. Okay, then. Glory. And then... Good save cast, but we want to be able to get rid of debuffs later by being able to buff with new buffs. So, I think we save save cast for that reason. Okay, we get a poison and a shock and another poison. That's pretty good. Okay, we didn't get blinded. That's nice. Yes, I did. Okay. Well, we tried. Uh, helping hand. Save me. Okay, that was good. Uh, safe cast. We got rid of some of the debuffs. That's good. And then... These guys have, like, the same amount of HP, so we'll do this. Alright, two down, one to go. And now... We lay down the smackdown. There it is. All right, then. We get four stars. Another Nautilid egg. Well, that one's for the monster army, I suppose. Forward, Nautilid. Hello, friends. Look at that champion over there. That must be an Elder Gel. I've heard a lot about them, but I've never seen one before. They say an Elder Gel only grows more powerful over time. So if you take too much time fighting one, it will only become stronger and stronger. A fight with this kind of dangerous champion monster is no child's play. Only an experienced keeper can bear this burden. Of course, I'll have to be the one to take on this champion monster. I think we should let Jalanon try beating this champion. What? You've got to be joking. We still owe something to Jalanon. We'd probably be still stuck in that pit without him. What? Oh, come on. It's dangerous for him, so it'd be negligent to just let him rush headfirst into a fight like that. That's not true, and you know that. Somebody who's come this far at least deserves a chance. Maybe he'll surprise us. Oh, all right. You can be as stubborn as an ox sometimes. Hey, wait a minute. Aren't you all forgetting something? I didn't get saved by Jalanon out of any pit. So why should I let him fight the Elder Gel? I know just how to settle this like responsible keepers. Let's have a keeper duel, Jalanon. 
the winner gets to bite that elder gel and get all the glory. How about it? Are you ready for it? Yes. All right. I challenge you to a keeper duel, Dan. Keeper duel. I've collected monsters from all across the sanctuary. My team represents my journey as a monster keeper. And mine represents power. So yes. And laser beams. And giant eyeballs. Hmm. Well, let's do the ice shield. That seems like a good plan. Shielding will be important here. All right. Burrow. Generating a barrier and some damage. It's a good skill. Good skill. Hmm. Right on glory cast. Let us... I guess we'll do helping hand first. Yeah. Then ice shield. Hmm. Then do we go for the Frosty? We could go for the Amori. I think we go for the Frosty because it can shield. Okay, well we got rid of some of that guy's buffs, that's good. The Amori's going to die to its debuffs at some point soon. As damaging as it is. Hmm. Okay, looks like Julia's going for more AoE as well. Intriguing. Hmm. I think I Life Wave here. Get rid of some debuffs. I could full offense. Let's safe cast. Get rid of some more debuffs. There we go. And then. Hmm. What is the bear weak to? Acid Rain? We'll do that. It does get charge stacks, but it might die to debuffs. No, I didn't get any of those. Curses. Okay. Still doing pretty well, though. We've got two aging stacks on Oculus. Hmm. More life wave just for the shield. Hmm. I think we do this. Try to get some chill on this guy. No? Fine. Hmm. Did I full offense you yet, though? I think I did. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Best against you, huh? Okay, it should die to the chill stuff. Yes. Well, I, I don't need the damage from Acid Rain as much right now, so let's do this. Try to get the Caraglow a little bit debuffed. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, the Mole Bear's still doing better than I had thought. Hmm. I'll do this. Okay. I guess... I kind of want more chills, actually, so we'll do this. We didn't really need a shield on more than one character, but that's fine. We'll do Spore on the Cat Zerker because it can hit like a truck. Okay, there we go. Alright. Doing okay so far. The Caraglow is going to be kind of annoying with how we're trying to deal damage. I'm glad we made the Cat Zerker weaker. Mm, we'll just do this. Okay. Should die to debuffs. Hmm, I think I'll do full offense on Chewy. Try to get rid of some of these debuffs. There we go. And then... Ignite the Cat Zerker. Oh, never mind. Well, that happened. Okay, then. There goes my debuffs. Hmm. Big Thunderstorm. Lots of shocking. Hmm. Life Wave. There we go. No more bleed. Well, ice shield because now we need more chills. There we go. And then I guess I will spore the Cat Zerker again. There we go. Yes. Okay, Cat Zerker down. We're down to just two monsters. We have the advantage. All right then. Hmm. Could helping hand. Let's do that. Get a new sidekick buff on you. Still get the most chill debuffs by doing Ice Shield, so we'll do that. Acid Rain. Voltage doesn't get resisted, so that's why I'm doing that. Oh, the bird lived. Okay. Hmm. Spectral Eagle. Looks to have some sort of potential revival. Hmm. Okay, well, we'll do this. Work on the character. Yeah. Okay. 
What do I want to do against you, Ignite? Okay. There we go. Alright, Julia. I have proved my worth. And got a skill push. Wow, I honestly thought that'd be an easy win against a newcomer like you. It teaches me not to underestimate you. Alright then, you can go ahead and fight that Elder Gel. You've definitely earned it. Excellent. So first, skill point on Draconoth. What do we do with you? Phalanx to the whole party? Hmm. Hmm. I think we go with Phalanx level 3 or Forge. We'll do that. We'll do that. And then we'll think about life. Yeah. Hello, Elder Gel. Fancy meeting you here. Okay. So I think I still Glory Cast first. Hmm. Let's stack those chills. Yes. What are you weakest to? Nothing. Okay, so let's get the Ignite for sure. There we go. We got a random shock as well thrown in there, and an armor break. Well, okay then. That's also a shocker. Okay. Hmm. What are you weak to again? Like Psychic or something? Okay, interesting. Well, let's get the Helping Hand. Hmm. We could do Safe Cast. That might be best. Yeah. I also have the best chance of getting rid of all of our debuffs. Okay, you're already shocked and stuff. Let's give you weakness in case you don't already have it. Okay. Oh, and we got some stacks of poison and stuff. All right, all right. Seems to be working so far. This thing's pretty tanky, though. And it's getting age stacks, which isn't good for our health. Um, I guess I will helping hand on Frosty. Okay. Hmm, what's Ice Shield? Okay, we didn't stack any more chills, unfortunately. Hmm. So you've got, like, every debuff already, right? Except for weakness. So I guess we'll do that, too, just to make sure. Yeah, okay. So that's another debuff on there, which also means we should deal increased damage and take less damage from it. Hmm. Good thing it didn't spend its whole turn healing. That would have been annoying. Okay, you take more damage from physical neutral stuff. Hmm. Well, we'll try it. We'll try it. And then... A good full offense. Okay. So I got those. Can I stack any more burns on you? Maybe. We'll try it. Okay, we did. Good. Excellent. It does seem to be resisting these. And it just got rid of a bunch of them is also unfortunate. I guess what I'm going to do, Ice Shield, just to make sure we have the chills. Yeah, okay. Then we'll do Beating while it has a higher combo, so then it does more damage in theory. Uh, you're no longer shocked, so we'll do Voltage. There we go. Okay. So, damage is piling up. Hopefully it'll work out. We got two armor breaks on the... Ah, you're removing the debuffs. Okay. Hmm. So yeah, we still can do an, one more stack of chill. We want voltage again. So I think what I do, weirdly enough, is like chilling wind first. And then instead of you, we do voltage first. And then we do our normal attack. Because we've got the voltage hit and the armor breaks. Yeah. Seems to be working okay even with some of the cleansing effect. Okay. And now we to jail. Hmm. What do we want to do to you? I guess we still chilling wind. I could have done full offense on Chewy. Maybe that would have made more sense. Probably would have made more sense. Okay. And then what do we want? Let's see if we can't get a third burn. Got another stack of weakness randomly. It's kind of nice. Okay. Whirlpool is cleansing itself. Okay. Hmm. And now... We've got a stack of basically every kind of debuff we want. So that's good. Hmm. So I think I full offense on Chewy. There we go. Hmm. What deals the most damage here? 
330 from voltage. Okay. That seems best. We do that. And get another random poison and chill. Okay. And then we get the punches. That's right. Okay. There we go. Eight turns, though. Four stars, I'll take it. A pirate hook and a ward box level two. Okay, man. I wonder if a crocodile put that in a treasure chest. You will send it to Keeper Knight Rank. New items available to traders. Well done. You handled that champion like a pro. Seems like that champion wasn't so tough after all. Now let's see what's in those treasure chests. Treasure! There's a lot of gold in here. Jackpot! This one seems to have some trinkets of sorts. Not sure what they're worth. I guess you can have them, Jelena. Let's split the gold by three. After all, we all helped to open the entrance to the treasure cave. All right, I'll take my share. I just want you to know, I let you fight that champion, so I don't owe you anything anymore. We're square now. Being a spectral keeper means more than just beating a couple champions. We'll see if you can prove yourself in the long run. It was fun, wasn't it? I love Horizon Beach. It's my favorite place in the whole sanctuary. But we can't just relax and have fun while there's trouble going on in the monster sanctuary. I left you your share in that treasure chest. But don't forget to check out the other treasure chest as well. Might be something useful for you in there. I'm sure we'll meet again soon. Oh, Craven. Goodbye, Julian. Goodbye, friends. Until next time. 2,000 gold. Sanctuary token. Great. We found another one of the sanctuary tokens. I think that we have all the sanctuary tokens we need now. The Oracle said that the tokens will open the path to the deepest area of the sanctuary. Sounds spooky, doesn't it? I think there was a strange door at the deepest point of Blue Caves. That must be it. Let's go there. Achievement unlocked, Dread Pirate Carter. Okay. I think there's something else waiting for us, though. Yes? The Magma Chamber. Ooh. La la. Hello, friend. Uh, who's that? A Lumen, isn't you? What, you think you can just barge into me shop like that? Well, all right, mate. You're me first customer, eh? Welcome to your first and only shop endorsed by the official Goblin Miners Union. What, you're wondering why I'm talking and all of that? All of us goblins can talk, mate. You're just never gone and tried talking to a goblin before, have you, mister? Anyway, your merchandise is exclusive, mind you. I only got one of each. So see anything you like, mate? Let's see. Skill potion. Switch stone. And a shift stone. Hmm... I kind of want the shift stone, I think, and the skill potion. Buy one. Do do do. Okay. And I don't think I need another switch stone, so I think we're good there. I could sell to you, which is interesting, but we're not gonna. Anything else to say for yourself? Nothing else, huh? Okay. Well, good to meet you, sir. And let's try tackling the wall. Okay, nothing. All right. Well, we found the Goblin Miners Union. Yoink. Let's try tackling some stuff. Nothing. Nothing again. All right. Here we go, not a lead. Oh, okay. Nothing. Unfortunate. Okay, Koi. Away we'll go. Hmm. So I can open this up now. And then we could explore some more. Seems like a good plan. Really? So. Hmm. We got some time. Let's see then. I'm trying to take a look at my notes real fast. Hmm. Ninky Nanka. Yeah, life overload seems fine on you. More health as well. Okay. Cascade seems fine too. Chewy, on the other hand, what do we want on you? I think... Hmm. We can get a fourth level of Ice Hail. We will need that. I can get the Power Healing. Yeah, we'll just do that. Okay. Frosty. My little snowman. We barely use the normal shield anymore. Uh, let's try... Try a tenacious barrier. Yeah. Okay. Oculus. Hmm. We can go with more magic. We can get the dodginess. I think.
think this is new, Occult Control? Yeah, it's not on the notes I have. Okay, okay. Hmm. We could just go for mana and mana region values. We don't need it that much at the moment. Mana shielding. Yeah, let's do this. Ah! Mana shielding. There we go. Okay. A Ninky Nanka. We could do the Cascade and Life Overload and all that. Hmm. Let's get level four of this, and then we'll decide from there. Okay, Luna, what do we want to do with you? Hmm. We can get more chills. We can get more attack, that seems good as well. I did kind of want the ice spears, so then we could get bleed. I think I work towards here and just see how this goes too, and get more crit chance, that seems good. Okay. Yeah. We'll see how that goes, and we are good for now, actually. Hmm. Where do we want to go next? Because we can go deeper into the magma chamber, we might be able to unlock some things we didn't before. I didn't check out everything at Horizon Beach, but now we have a monster that can go against the currents. So I could try that, but clearly I want one of the monsters that can generate the platforms. Hmm. So I think it's time to go to the blue caves. We have improved flying as well. That's a new thing. I think we'll go to the blue caves though. So let's go to the teleporter. Oh. Ah. And jump straight into combat. Okay. But yeah, after that, I think we'll just go down to the next area. So we'll do this. Get some ice shields. Get some spores. Get a burn as well. Okay, almost enough. Ah, but they have forge. Okay. Hmm. Alright, still not into our health yet, so that's kind of nice. Could helping hand. Let's just life wave for some more shields. And then we have options. We'll save cast. Okay. And then, what do we want to do against the goblins? I think we'll voltage the goblins. Okay. There we go. Alright, we didn't get any burns with that voltage. Okay, now we can helping hand, because why not? Hmm. We can get more chills. More voltage? Sure. Spread the damage. Yes, okay. What do we get? For some volcanic ash. And a goblin miner. Okay, then. We already have one goblin miner, so I don't need that one. All right, then. And I should get out Orum Tail. Here we go, friend. Hop to it. Ho ho ho. Yoink. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> I overcorrected. I could just run. This is a truth. Also, I could use Luna and maybe do more AoEs and maybe that'd be faster. Hmm. Possible. Very possible. Okay. Well, we took out one monster already. That's pretty good. Hmm. What do we want here? Hmm, I guess we'll do some damage, because we can. Another stack of chill. Okay. And maybe we get a free burn. We got free poison and burn. Okay. Yeah, that's what we want. Alright then. Punches. Punches of punches. And your weakest is spore. Okay. Very good. We have made it through. I'm surprised we only got four stars for that. But okay. Hmm. Onward. Here's the rune stone. Here's the teleporter. So we could stop at the sanctuary, see if there's anything we really want from the traders and the blacksmith and all that. Hmm. We'll check it out. We'll check it out. 
All right, any new food? Looks like 300 gold for the new food. Okay. And then you. Potion, smoke bombs. We can buy those pretty cheap. Another crystal shard. How many do I have? I have nine, so I don't need it. Okay. Skill resetter, phoenix tier. Okay, we should be good. Hmm. And then we can get plus fours for the orb and the katar. Hmm. I think we'll wait, though. So far, we've actually been kind of keeping up with the power curve pretty well. Clearly, we're not getting the five stars like I want all the time, but that's okay. We'll make do. Hmm. Could try some of the other champion monsters and stuff, but I think we just head down to the blue caves unless, do I need to talk to anybody? Alchemist plot. Hmm. We have the sanctuary tokens. Okay, extinct species. Oh, right, we can get the shock hopper now. Yeah, so that's an option. And the rare seashells, we found a couple of them. Memorial ring. Hmm. Another look in the treasure cave. Interesting. Wanderer in a scorch. Magma chamber next. Okay, and the blob mystery. Okay, so I think we're just going to go to the blue caves. Continue the main storyline. Because I do want to do the DLC content as well at some point. Which should be, you know, in the near future, I'm supposing. Alright, so we'll jump down here. Should be able to get through... Do I still not have what I need for this? <laughs> ah, okay. Well, hmm. I feel like maybe I need a troll or something. Hmm. I could also try to get my dragon evolved to one of the final dragons I want. Hmm. I think where we're trying to go is over here. Let me remember. Is this correct? This is correct. Okay. What a strange door. It feels a bit ominous to be standing right in front of it, doesn't it? According to what Eric told us, we need to find the key of power to unlock the abandoned tower, where Marduk is supposed to be hiding. A frozen oracle told us that we'd need to explore the lowest area of the sanctuary to find what we're seeking. Okay. We've explored Snowy Peak, Sun Palace, Horizon Beach, and Magma Chamber and found a sanctuary token in each of those areas. It seems like there's a fifth sanctuary token we're still missing. Oh. Hey, John One. You might be surprised, but I've been keeping a close watch on your progress. Mad Eyes are quite useful monsters for surveillance purposes. Giant Eyeball. Who figured? I know that you've collected the four sanctuary tokens hidden throughout the sanctuary. So I take it you believe that the key of power is in the forbidden area behind that door. That area is closed off for a good reason. No ordinary monster keeper should ever set foot in it. I have the fifth sanctuary token, which would allow you to open that door. But I'm not sure if I can give it to you. I know that you've already risen to the rank of Keeper Knight, and I congratulate you for that. You're doing the sanctuary a great service. However, you're still a relatively young keeper. Talented, perhaps. But you may still lack the experience needed to explore such a dangerous area. That is why I will test your skills as a monster keeper by challenging you to a keeper duel. If you win, you shall have my sanctuary token. We've come far enough to be able to compete with Keeper Dragoon Eric. Let's take him on. Let's see if you can handle real combat. Okay, well dear viewer, next time, join us for a keeper duel with Keeper Dragoon Eric. I hope you, dear viewer, have a great day.